Hey, y'all. I hope everybody is doing well. I just wanted to come on here and talk about a few things. It's a sad day for me today because R. Kelly was locked up a year ago by the government and he's being held against his will out there in Chicago based on the false allegations of some dirty whores. And um, I'm sick of him being locked up. It's been a whole year. He has served more time in jail than the killers of Eric Garner. The cops who killed Eric Garner still have not been arrested. The cops who killed Breonna Taylor still have not been arrested. They shot Breonna Taylor while she slept and they're at home chilling right now. But R. Kelly is locked up by the feds based on allegations from 30 years ago. And, and, and it's wrong. It's fucking wrong. I hate these people, man. I wish he never married Dre. I, I, I swear, every time I, every, today I was just angry because I'm like, why did, I, why did he have to meet and fall in love with Dre who never cared about him, man? Dre said uh, he raped her. What a dirty haul. That's your fucking husband, bitch. She's already in jail, you filthy fucking whore. Why are you still making statements? And he couldn't have been that dangerous because you're still talking about him like he is, uh, you know, like he's, how come you haven't been killed if he was that dangerous? I really do not like that woman. I really do not like that woman. I hate Dre. I wish he never got that slut pregnant. He could have had any woman who loved him. But like I told y'all in my Drea video, he chose Drea because he recognized that she was an abuser subconsciously because he was abused as a child. So he attracted, he, he subconsciously was attracted to women who didn't love him and who mistreated him because of his abuse as a child. It's a form of self-abasement, you know. But hopefully now that he's in jail and he has had time to think, hopefully he works through that. Because he's away from him now. The only good thing about him being in jail is that he's away from these treacherous people. That's the only blessing. I wish he never met Azriel. I wish he never met Joycelyn. And all of these people. Oh, I'm so sick of him. God bless R. Kelly. I really love that man. I wish I could give him a hug. The prison is getting ready to go back into another 30 days of lockdown. So he's going to be in his cell for another 30 days. He, meaning he can't walk around outside and get some exercise, which he desperately needs. He needs to have exercise because there is no healthy food in jail and he's, keeps, he, he's gaining weight when he needs to begin that weight down because of the diabetes. But you know what? I just want him alive and healthy and out of jail. That's the only thing I want. I've been praying for him, you know. It's a shame how people who never met R. Kelly have more love in their hearts for him than his own damn mother of his children. I could never treat somebody like this, you know? I, I, I respect marriage too much. I respect family too much. I just couldn't be a dirty bitch like this. I couldn't treat somebody like this, man. I don't care. Could be my worst enemy. I wouldn't even try to put him in the feds. Oh my God. These are some dirty people. These are some dirty people. He's in jail, suffering. After all the money he gave that ungrateful whore named Trey and those bastard children. I swear to God, I hate his fucking kids and I don't care if y'all don't like it. I don't like R. Kelly's kids. I think they're disgusting. Your father is in jail. Show him some fucking res respect and some fucking support. 
show the man that put a roof over your head some fucking support and stop being so fucking disrespectful. I hate his fucking kids. I don't for talking, oh, are we going to donate to his kids? Hell no, these are grown adults. They want to disrespect their father and have him thrown in jail. Then they need to get out here and get a fucking job like the rest of us. They're adults. Why are they exempt from working? Why are they exempt from working? R. Kelly is a wonderful human being. I hate these whores. I hate that he's still locked up for a year. But can't nobody say he didn't do any, he hasn't faced consequences. People love to say R. Kelly never faced consequences for his accusations. Every time he has been accused, he has either had to pay a lawsuit or get arrested. Nobody has been held accountable more than black men. Black men always get held accountable. So I don't know where, why people keep saying R. Kelly never been held accountable. He has been held accountable. They dragged him through the mud. I don't treat an animal the way they treated R. Kelly. Why doesn't he have a bond? But the good news about him being locked up too is that he gained a lot of sympathy. A lot of people started feeling sorry for him. A lot of people started seeing the injustice once he got locked up because then they're saying, wait, why is Joycelyn still there if she's a hostage? Because he been locked up a year. R. Kelly has been locked up a year. There are no hostages. That was proof that there were no hostages. Azriel still stayed after he got locked up. I really hate that bitch, Azriel. I really want to see her have a downfall. She will not get away with this, though. You don't treat somebody like this and think it's cute. You don't send somebody to the feds and think that karma's not going to come get you. You dirty haul. You federal informant, bitch. I swear to God, I'm pissed today. I had to... Luckily, I'm outside walking. I had to walk to calm myself down. Because I was so pissed, I thought about R. Kelly being in that dirty jail. And I wanted him out so he could go home, take a nice hot shower, and lay in his bed, watch TV, and get a fair shake. But they don't want to do that. I hate them all. I hate Drea with a passion. The woman is evil, the woman is demonic, the woman is satanic. She has no love in her heart. I do not like Drea Lee. She's still holding on to R. Kelly's last name. Bitch, why are you holding on to his last name if he raped you? You dirty whore. They might add Drea to the indictments. Trying to say marital rape. They're trying to throw everything at this man. I'm disgusted. I hate Tim Savage. I hate Jondalyn Savage. I hate Angelo fucking Clary. If I could kill these people and get away with it, I would. But I don't want to go to jail. I'm going to let God deal with them because every dog has its day. You sit up here and you, 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 you throw a man in jail for a whole fucking year for no reason talking about he's an animal, he's a this, he's a that. Everything but a child of God after he took care of your whoring daughters. He took care of your whoring daughters, not you. I wish you never fucking met him. Never meant that much a bunch of backstabbing bastards and whores in my life. So many Federal informant, bitch, Azriel. I swear to God. How do these people get? How do these people sleep at night knowing they're federal informant? Talk about some Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. You don't run to no fucking feds. How you gonna talk against the police but work with the police at the same damn time? That makes no sense. 
all. I'm sick of it. Let me sit down right here. Should I walk down to the lake? Probably. Let me sit down for a second, finish this video. Talk, 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 talk. Uh, I've been having a good summer. Jada Pinkett should have really apologized to Will yesterday. She should have said that she was wrong. I, I, I was missing the apology. I felt like she should apologize for putting her family at risk. Not for the sex. She said, I apologize for putting our family at risk at bringing in an individual who didn't care anything about me because I was in pain and I, didn't, I wasn't thinking that I'm sorry and I'm glad for your forgiveness. I was wrong. I think that would have went over a lot better than the statement that she made about not being a transgression. Yes, it was a transgression. You're a fucking married woman. And why doesn't Jada wear her wedding ring? Why is it that Jada doesn't wear her wedding ring? That is a, didn't, didn't Will get her a million dollar ring when he got married to her? Why doesn't she wear her beautiful wedding ring? You're a married woman. That's something to be proud of. Why does she want to be an Instagram thought? Why is she not proud of being a married woman? It's a lot of women want to be in her position. It's a lot of women want to have a husband that buy them a million dollar ring. And who want to cause their husband the embarrassment that Jada has brought her husband? I don't care how many women he slept with. You don't get him back like that. You sleep with somebody who could have been um, discreet. She, like I said in my previous video, she should have got with like a Denzel or somebody like that. Somebody that, you know, would have been discreet about the whole thing. You don't go get with, with a boy with mental issues that, 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 that can't hold water, that is a messy, he's a messy, oh, he's a messy little thing. August Alcina has lost a lot of points, a lot of cool points by going on and on about this and he, He's supposed to be releasing some more statements. I'm like, okay, she, she admitted that she was a dirty whore. It's time to move on, you know. But again, Jada brought it on herself. Jada brought it on herself. When Jada had sex with August Alcina, she brought the whole shit on herself because she allowed this man into her home. She had the most to lose. She knew she was married to Will Smith. Why are you sitting up there going to BET Awards with another man? Why are you sitting up an August Alcina? The whole thing is ridiculous, man. I'm sick of it. You sit up here. I hope those little girls walk home before it gets dark. Um, I was looking at these, these little girls out here playing. But um, at the end of the day... Uh, What can I say? Jada's a filthy fucking whore. She did not give one damn about Will. She does not wear her wedding ring. It's like she takes no pride in being a wife. I don't know what happened. Why does she want to be a single thought? She should be proud of being a, a, a married woman of 24 years. That is something to be proud of. That is something to be proud of. I don't know why she runs from it, but I hope she heals from whatever it is. But now that she's gotten called out by August Alcina, she got to move correct. She can't be out here with any other random dude. And also, she's looking desperate in the public because let me tell you something. If Will Smith left her tomorrow, you know he's going to get the baddest chick. He's going to get like a 28-year-old chick that's bad, that's a model, and he's probably going to have more kids. But Jada's not going to have the same luck because she's an older woman. Older men can always have their pickings, but older women really can't get their pickings like that, especially after you are known for sleeping with August Alcina. You know, you don't, you know, August Alcina is, you could tell August Alcina never cared about her because he wouldn't have even been humiliating her. He, I think he gets joy out of humiliating Jada because Jada did not leave Will for him. 
So he takes so much joy in this. And he talking about he could have said more than what he said. And maybe he needs to say more. Uh, then say it all. Say it all and go on YouTube. Say everything that y'all did in the relationship. Say it one time and then leave it alone. If that's what's going to make you heal, August, do it. Say it one time and then leave it alone. But it, it looks like harassment at this point. You keep going at Jada. Yes, she's already been humiliated. They dragged her. We dragged her. We called her a whore. We called her a thot. We said she should have picked a better side dude. She should have picked someone in her age range. She should have picked someone else in Hollywood like a Denzel or maybe a Morris Chestnut. I could see Morris Chestnut and Jada. Morris Chestnut been with his wife for 20-some years, almost 30 years. So, you know, he won't mess up his marriage. And, and you know, they could have had something going on. That would have been a, a reasonable pick, Jada. Denzel or Morris Chestnut or uh, maybe Lorenz Tate, Jada. Lorenz Tate has been married, so he's not going to leave his wife and daughters. So at the end of the day, Lorenz. Or maybe a Tyrese, somebody like that. That's who you, Tyrese is who you should have been sleeping with. That's who you should have been having sex with. And I know August Alcina. She just messed up a whole family, like embarrassed her children. And this woman acting like it's all good. It's not all fucking good. And you can see the pain in Will's face because he hates the fact that his image of a family, because you know, Will, Will is a perfectionist. And he has always wanted to have, oh, my kid's doing well, me and my marriage is strong. I want to have the perfect picture, perfect family. Because he, he came from abuse where his dad would beat his mother. And even though he loved his dad, he always said, I didn't want any violence in my household. I just wanted to not mistreat my wife in any shape or way, shape or form. And I wanted to make sure my family was good. I wanted to make sure my family was good. So at the end of the day, uh, he's hurt mainly because of that image has been shattered because a lot of people are looking at him as weak. They're saying, oh, oh, oh. A lot of men are saying, I would divorce her, I would divorce her. She's a goddamn whore. She's for the streets. But other people are looking at it like, wow, Jada is a damn whore. You know, Will is so strong for st sticking by her. But I... I Will's not going to divorce her. Will is not going to divorce her. But he's miserable. The embarrassment. You don't embarrass your husband and your children like that. It's different when a man cheats. Let me know Will has cheated. It's a difference when a man cheats versus a woman. Because Jada spread her legs for August. Men look at that different. It's just different than when a man cheats. Like, we already expect men to go out there. But the difference is, Will did not sit up there and... Um, Embarrass her. Where are Will Smith's side women? I'm starting to believe Will Smith never cheated his whole time. Because we hadn't heard one woman come forward and say that Will Smith had sex with me. And I think it's because he has maybe slept with women in Hollywood who also have husbands who, who have a lot to lose. And maybe that's why he hasn't gotten caught up. And that's the same thing that Jada should have did to not embarrass her family. If they were on a break, yeah, you're on a break. Will Smith did what she wanted to do, what he wanted to do. She did what she wanted to do. The difference is that she got caught and embarrassed her children. And August Alcida was a friend to Jaden. And wasn't he hanging around Willow? And people thought that he was dating Willow at first. People was like, oh, Willow's kind of young for August, but maybe they're waiting until she gets 18 and they're going to go public. I thought he was dating Willow at first. I thought... Willow was someone he was courting and he was going to have sex with her when she turned, when she became of age. But then after I saw him hugged up with Jada, I said, oh, this was years ago. I said, oh, yeah, he's having sex with Jada. Willow, him, him hanging out with Willow was just a front for him having sex with Jada. How can you call that boy your son and then have sex with him? If Jada were a man, she'd be in jail right now. They'd be trying to arrest her and do documentaries and all kinds of stuff for taking advantage of a mentally ill 20-some-year-old girl and knowing, not knowing his power. It would have been a Me Too situation. If Will had done this, if Will, pick, pick, picture like an Ariana Grande having sex with Will Smith and Ariana Grande saying, I had mental issues, I fell in love, 
and I wish I, if I died now, oh, I want to be with Will and all that, everybody would say, oh, my God, he brainwashed the chick. Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. Just picture any female singer. It would have been curtains for Will Smith in Hollywood. He would have been, they would have pulled Fresh Prince from the air. It would have been over. He would have been seen as the biggest monster. Of course, I wouldn't have painted him as a boss. I would have blamed the whore. I'd be like, damn whore, stop spreading your legs, bitch. You know me. But the media would have painted her as a saint and him as just this victim, uh, uh, as just this evil human being that took advantage of a little girl. Just like they did with R. Kelly, kept calling these grown women little girls. And I'm like, they kept saying little girls on indictments. I said, what little girls on indictments? You got 40-year-old woman on a child porn indictment. You got 40-year-old women on child porn indictments. What little girls? They cannot produce any little girls that R. Kelly has had sex with because it's been decades, these allegations. These allegations are decades old, and anybody could come back from the past and say, R. Kelly had sex with me when I was 15, and he might not even know the chick. How are they going to prove that he even knew these chicks from the past? These people made me sick, man. Free R. Kelly. Free R. Kelly. Free R. Kelly. Lock up Jada. Lock up Jada. Y'all think it's some more boys are gonna come forward against Jada and say that she pretended to be like a mother figure and they were friends with Jada and she had sex with him? You think some underage boys are gonna come forward or boys who were underage at the time? I can see that happening. I can see that happening. Jada had no business putting herself in this situation. I do not understand why a woman with everything that she has, millions of dollars, jewels, diamonds, pearls. You are married to Will Smith. Uh, why aren't you wearing your wedding ring? Why aren't you being a supportive wife? Why are you out here getting caught with men? You were supposed to sit up here and, 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 and. what about Michael Lealy? Was he not available for an affair? Where was Michael Lealy? Michael Lealy needs an affair. He looks like he needs some spice in his life. He's married. He has children. You know, he's not going to mess his wife up. Why, why not Michael Lealy? Why not Morris Chestnut? Why not Tyrese? Why not Denzel? Anybody. Idris Elba. Idris Elba. Why not Idris Elba? Like, it's so many available men that men who would have been happy to have sex with Jada just to say they did it, and she could have gotten her sex on without going after the, 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 the sickly boy. That sickly boy, August Alcina, he's a sickly boy, a sickly boy. I'm sick of the whole shit. I'm angry today. Uh, Kelly's still locked up a year later. Jada not wearing her million dollar ring. I wish I had a million dollar ring. The only thing I have, I don't have that much jewelry. I have like uh, a gold cross, a sideways gold cross. Everything I have is 14 karat gold. I have a couple 14 karat gold necklaces that I bought myself. Uh, I think I got a gold ring that I bought myself. Uh, I got some gold hoops some gold, large gold hoops, and everything else is gold filled. But I got, most of my jewelry is 14 karat gold. So I don't have anything super expensive, you know what I mean? But anything I have, I bought it myself, because I had some jewelry a few years back and I had to pawn it because I went through some financial difficulties. But then I went and I got some more necklaces and, you know, just cute stuff for me to um, have. 14 karat gold. I don't do fake jewels. Unless it's earrings. For earrings, I might get gold filled or, you know, some just some costume hoops because I love big hoops. Uh, but I typically don't um, get any sort of fake jewelry. It's going to be 14 karat gold. I like gold. But anyway, 
why is a woman who has all this uh, jewelry that her husband got and the million dollar rings, if you can't wear your million dollar ring, she could give me a million dollar ring. I'd rock it every day. I'd be married to Will Smith. This is an ungrateful bitch. Jada is a filthy fucking hoe. Azriel is a filthy fucking hoe. Lisa Van Allen is a filthy fucking hoe. Geronda Pace is a filthy fucking hoe. All of these people are filthy fucking hoes. Free R. Kelly. Free R. Kelly. Free R. Kelly. Lock up Tim Savage. Lock up Angelo. Lock up Tim Savage. Lock up Angelo. John Jalen is a dirty hoe. Alice Clary is a dirty, filthy fucking whore. Azriel is a filthy fucking whore, 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 whore.